So this is a short video about how to do the book RL and RC circuits. So this is a step response for RC for RL circuits. Um, so first we're going to draw the circuit for uh, T less than zero. And either we find the voltage across the capacitor or the current through the inductor. And then we draw or we use this circuit, or we draw it, to find tau and the voltage across the capacitor for T equals to infinity or tending to infinity or the current through in the inductor. Once we have these three numbers, they're usually scalars, we're going to write the final solution. So this is literally a matter of putting in the parameters. So this is a, an example circuit. There is one inductor, there are several resistors, and two power supplies. Uh, maybe I'll make this U of T to make it more interesting. So the question here will be, there's 10 milliamps turning on at U of T, which means it's zero until time starts, until T equals zero. This one is 5 volts until T equals 0, so it's uh, these two are the opposite of each other. So in the beginning, this one is turned off. I'm going to leave it open, but the 2 kilo ohms is the resistor is there. So when the, this power supply, the current supply is off, we leave it open. So I like turning the power supply off, but the 5 volts is there. So this is my circuit. Or t less than zero, there is a 1k here, 1k here, 2k here, and this is the inductor. I'm only labeling it with IL because it's IL until zero, and in this case it's 5 volts, so the way to draw this is literally the 5 volts for t less than zero. So I have 2 in parallel with 1 here. I need this current, which is going to be twice as big as that, but for the current, the total current through the circuit, I'm going to say that it's uh, 5 divided by the equivalent resistance, which is 1k plus, plus the equivalent between 2 and 1, which is going to be 2 thirds of a k. So it's 5, div 5 divided by 1 point whatever. 7k, which I'm going to call like 3 milliamps. And so IL will be approximately approximately 2 milliamps. You realize I don't have a calculator here. And this is the uh, IL at 0 minus. So this is the current through the inductor in this particular direction just before the switch turns this on and turns this off. For t larger than zero, I'm going to have a different circuit. So I do expect you to draw two circuits, mainly in this case. Um, this turns off, which means that it shorts, and this turn is on. Marker, which I don't, so 10 milli, 2k, and now I don't want to write, draw the inductor, and this is the 1k, this is the 1k, this is the inductor, it looks like the inductor doesn't have a, a value here, huh? 2k, and the IO is still going down. I'm copying it from the top circuit. So now I'm interested in finding uh, tau, which in the case of the circuit is L over R. So I have L, and the R is what the inductor sees, which is this open, and then 1k in series with the. Well, 
Let's let's draw that. This is the inductor. So this is the L, and I'm measuring the impedance or the resistance between these two terminals, which is the 1K. In series with the 2K, that's in parallel with 1K, which is more or less what we just did. So this R for this particular case, I'm going to call 1.7K, and L is 2. So tau will be 2 divided by 1.7K which is a little bit larger than one. Uh, well, almost one actually. So I'm gonna leave it like this and I'm gonna put this in exponent. The point now is to find the IL of infinity, which is going to be a negative number. And now these three are in parallel. So it's 10 milli. Uh, one and one K. So here, watch. It's ten milli, and now I have two K, and this guy is zero point five K. So this current here, I to the zero point five is minus ten milli times two divided by two point five. I to the 0 0.5 will be 8 milli, and basically IL is half of that. So IL is minus 4 milliamps. I realize you can do this in any other way. I just want to make sure we have a number to plug into the final solution. So IL of T, which is a final question is to find out L of t, you'd answer then by plugging these three numbers into our predefined formula is I L of infinity minus 4 minus 4 milli plus this is 2 minus 4 2 milli minus 4 milli times the exponent exponential 2, the minus t, divided by tau, which is 1.7k divided by 2 amps. I hope that explains how I am expecting to solve RL circuits uh, by analyzing two different circuits, one for t less than 0, one for t larger than 0.